surprise guess who just got herself some stickers this squirrel cat right here miss casey has stickers which means i can do more videos for you guys so i have been a fursuit maker for about over two years now and you may not know this because i don't think i've told any of you I work at an elementary school during the day as my day job, and I have been furloughed since mid-March, okay? So I've been home for almost six months. Now, instead of getting depressed and unproductive, I ramped up my fursuit making to 100%. Now, I know that my situation is different than a lot of other people's who are not as blessed to have a job to go back to after being in COVID quarantine for so long. And I was also able to collect unemployment. So I actually made more than I did before at work. And that's, I guess, thanks to Trump and the whole $600 extra a week. But the point being, I was able to show myself how well I could do the fursuit making, how productive I could be, how much I could learn over that time, while not being worried about, oh, I have to take every single commission because I need the money to live. It was, I can take what I want to do because I already felt secure. I know other fursuit makers who only do this as their base income, it can be very much full of anxiety day to day because you are living paycheck to paycheck. But I am just personally so proud of the decisions I've made over the last six months. And it's it's really shown me that I can do this. I, I am on the right path. I'm going to continue making the best quality suits I can because I want to do this for the rest of my life as long as I can. I love it. It's creative. It's an outlet for me. It wasn't until I saw a customer opening and doing a fursuit unboxing live on YouTube and I saw them crying with excitement and I, I saw the emotion and the realism that it brought to them for their character. And that is why I'm doing this. So I am going back to work tomorrow and I am terrified and excited at the same time, believe me. I know I won't be able to do as much fursuit making as I used to, but I still wanna do that. And I actually have a $3,000 full body fursuit that is on my queue now and I'm super excited to do it. So for the next couple months, as long as it takes me to make this deluxe fursuit, I want to capture all of the essence of the process, the materials I use, the steps that I take and really capture, you know, the whole experience. But anyway, that is what I would like to do with my channel in the next couple months and keep you guys posted. I hope you enjoyed this little impromptu video, a little catch up, a little tea time, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.